Hello, I'm Gary Patterson, moderator of the United Church of Canada. As people of faith, we in the United Church believe that the earth cannot be understood only as a source of resource extraction and wealth generation, but rather as a community in which we live and move and have our being, a gift, a wonder, a home for us and for all our relations. But our beloved earth is in trouble. And so I'm calling on all of us to do something about climate change. But why am I asking at this precise moment, other than the overwhelming urgency of what's happening? Well, on September 23rd, a major United Nations summit on climate change is taking place in New York City. And immediately before that, there will be an interfaith summit and a people's climate march. We're anticipating mobilization around climate change like we've never seen before. We in the United Church need to continue our active involvement in this global interfaith movement as we add our voices to the millions of others demanding that enough is enough. Climate justice is one of the key ethical and moral challenges for our time. As we proclaim in our creed, we are called to be the church to live with respect in creation. Millions of people have already lost their homes and their livelihoods as a result of climate change. Yet government response remains profoundly inadequate and fails to secure a safe and just future for all. In the words of UN Secretary General Ban Ki-moon to world leaders, bring bold announcements and actions to the upcoming summit that will reduce emissions, strengthen climate resilience, and mobilize political will for a meaningful legal agreement in 2015. But so far, the Canadian government hasn't even said it will attend the meeting. Canadians, people like you and me, we need to contact our elected officials to get with it. So what can you do? Well, lots, actually. Learn more about the issues. The research is out there. Ensure that issues of climate change are part of your Sunday worship. There are lots of available resources. Have a Sunday, or two, or three, or many, where people are encouraged to walk, bike, or take the bus to church. Write a letter to the editor of your local paper. Spread the word. Talk to your friends and neighbors. Make a personal pledge to change your ways. And contact your MP and demand action from our government. The time is now. It can no longer wait. There is no planet B.